everybody and welcome back to my channel. So uh, today is kind of an impromptu video, hence my appearance, but I am wearing my nine and three quarters um, Harry Potter platform nine and three quarters um, shirt because I had picked up um, four of these mystery wand um, boxes from Walmart and I am just I saw these um, on another channel and the quality of the wand looked really nice and they were so intricate and I was just really intrigued so I said next time I go out I'm gonna pick them up and I'll do an unboxing and I also had some odds and odds and ends that I was like you know what I'm just gonna plop everything into a video and put it out because I wasn't really sure what I wanted to do in another video and my house is so cold because it's kind of warm in, in the day at ugh, my goodness it's warm during the day it's cold at night and then we have like a couple cold days so I have this like huge oversized sweater on can you see Jasmine peeking out so this is like a triple X sweater <laughs> so I got four of them so I will read off who we could get. These are the Series 2 ones. I will read off who we could get. I'm really just hoping for no duplicates. Um, they had a bunch there. I wanted to get more, but they were $13.88, I believe. Um, I was hoping they were going to be more like $10. Um, not that the extra $4 like broke me, but... Um, yeah, so I'm going to do this and then I'll go into like what I got in the mail extra. So your options are, contains one of nine mystery wands. So you could get Sirius Black, Arthur Weasley, um, um, Narsica Malfoy, um, James Potter, Victor Crumb, Ginny Weasley, Cho Chang, uh, Severus Snape, and Albus Dumbledore. Wow, that was a mouthful. So let's open these up. They look like they are incredible quality. I mean, for $13.88, you get what you get. But from what I saw on the other channel, it looked like the, the carvings on them were really great. So let me stop talking. Let's, oh wait. So it says, Wands measure 12 inches, includes a mystery wand, wand box, and matching character 3D bookmark. That's kind of cool. So, not that I need any more um, bookmarks, but you never know. So, let's um, get into it. Take a sip of... Energy. Okay. Um... For some reason, I feel like this is a different series than I saw, though. Maybe not. All right, let's see who we get. It has a little... So here, I'll show you really quick. So those are the wands that you can get. It shows you over there. See how they kind of look really intricate? And then it shows you the wands you could get. And this is... Uh, on the front of the box. So the box is pretty good size. So let's tear it open. Ooh, even the box is nice. I was just expecting like a black box. So this is what the box itself looks like. Um, so this is Harry Potter on the front. Oh, so it is kind of legit. It says WB Wizarding World. Okay, so for $13.88, I guess it's a little bit legit. It's um, Forbidden uh, Forest, Forbidden Forest, Contact the Ministry, um, Extracurricular Activities. So actually, these boxes are really nice. So this probably isn't something that I'd throw away. So I'm not sure if you can zoom in and see. So it has like the school crest on it or the house crest on it for houses. Um, it does look really neat. So even if you don't keep 
all the boxes, you can at least keep one of them. Come on the back. Um, so yeah, let's open up one. I don't really want to ruin the box. So then it has just this like black plastic. Let's see if I can recognize the one. Some of the ones I'll be able to recognize. Ooh, this one I don't think I will. Ooh, except for it just fell out. Oh, this is super, super cool. Oh my goodness. So the card is actually holograph holographic or 3D. Um, that is super cool. <gasps> These are awesome. These are really awesome. I'm such a child. So that is super nice. And then the card that fell out is um, the Noble Collection Creators of Finely Crafted Treasure. Um, so actually, apparently, this is like a whole entire um, collection. So apparently, you can get a rack for these. So apparently, like, this is a legit thing. I did not know that. So this, is, I guess, is just a little book that you can get. This is a book in each thing that shows you um, the different pieces in um, um, the thing. So this is actually Harry's dad's wand, which is super neat, which I am super stoked about. And it's very heavy, like, compared to how heavy, like, the box was, I didn't anticipate, like, the wand being as heavy as it is. So it, have, it has these, like, cobwebs on it, um, and it says TM at WBE, so, I mean, this is really nice. I'm super stoked to have this, that is really nice, and that was a pretty strong start. Um... And I'm going to put him back in here. That is, that is really nice. And I didn't recognize that. It's probably not a good thing. But we need to brush up on my Harry Potter. I'm well, well overdue for watching the movies. But I'm waiting for my boyfriend's daughter to uh, read the, finish reading the books. So let's get on to number two. I had two boxes open, but I picked from the same box, hoping that I wouldn't get duplicates, so we'll see. Um, so there's nine, so let's hope that. The nice thing is that there's no, like, chaser, or there's no, like, um, there's no, like, mystery. Like, ooh, you know what I mean? Sometimes they black out a wand and they say, like, or you could get this one and you don't know whose it is until you get it. Or don't get it, you know? So same box. And let's open this one. I don't want to look at the wand. I just want to look at the... Oh, well, this is a different one. Oh, the card's on top. <gasps> yes. Okay, this one kind of makes me happy because being a Malfoy, so I split houses, I split, um, I split Slytherin and Gryffindor when I, every time I take the Pottermore, or the, it's not Pottermore anymore, um, the Wizarding World test, um, I either get Gryffindor or I get Slytherin, so I'm like, Anytime I get anything Slytherin or Gryffindor, I'm like super happy. So, and she just looks so fierce and so beautiful. And her wand is gorgeous. And this one is like ridiculously heavy. Like this part of her wand is like, this is like a weapon. This is like serious. I might actually try to, have to try to get all nine. It would be really nice if none of these are, are dupes, or are duplicates. That is like super nice. 
Wow, that's incredible. I might have to look into getting that um, that stand because I would love to be able to put these up. I actually just put up some of my ears. Those are only eight of them, and I figured out I have right now I have 11 pairs of ears, but I have a couple boxes. I have um, one, two, three boxes coming this month. Three. Um, Disney boxes, and there's probably a good chance I'll get in at least one more pair of ears. What did I do? Bye. So fingers crossed we get, I would love to get like, I don't know. I would love to get Sirius Black, honestly. I'd love to get Dumbledore, but I'd love to get like Sirius Black. I just, I feel like, That fifth book just really got to me. So I feel like I'd love, I'd love to get Sirius Black. Alright, I feel like the thing is on top. Same box. Ooh. Ha ha! This is a good one. Alright, I'm going to put it up so that you guys can see if you know whose this is. If you can recognize it. Oh, this is another really happy one and beautiful one. I need them all. I need them all. This is so gorgeous. It's like perfect. All right, here he is. And look at it. And I mean, I don't know. It does have that like reflect on it. But he doesn't do anything like um, James Potter had like the that holographic like moment, but um, Snape does not. All right, we have one more. Oh, I'm in love. I'm so in love. I'm really feeling these. <laughs> I really feel. I wish I got would have gotten like one more or two more. But I feel like if I would have did that, they would have been duplicates. So, okay, let's pray. Okay, so we're going to duplicate. To end on a high note. Let's end on a high note. Ready? Okay. I'll show you the... Oh, this is a good one. I know whose this is. I knew it before I even... I knew it before I even looked it out. Not a huge fan, but that's all right. At first glance, you could kind of get it wrong, but I think only a true Harry Potter fan would know this one. At first glance, you might get this one wrong, but the color should give it away. Anybody, anybody? So we didn't get any duplicates, which makes me so happy, but that only means I need five more. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Um, I am happy about James Potter and Snape. Those are probably the two I'm most happy about. Um, I could have did it without Victor Crumb, but obviously I need him to complete my set. So yes, so let's go through and see. Um, so I need Dumbledore. I need Dumbledore, Cho Chang, Ginny Weasley, Sirius Black, Arthur Weasley, and that's it. So it's five. I love the one. So I actually may stop the camera here and No, because I'm not going to get prescriptions anytime soon. Maybe I will be. Maybe I'll stop the camera and then maybe I'll stop this video and then I will. Mm, no, 
I'm not going to. I'm de I was debating it, but next time I go pick up prescriptions, then I will. Um, then I'll go pick up more, and then we'll see if we can fulfill our need. So let's switch gears. Let's do a little bit of an unboxing. Um, I got a couple of things in the mail, and I will share them with you really quickly. Um, so today is Easter, by the way. Happy Easter. I didn't even share that. It's so hard because we had the kids until noon, and so like now the day is like kind of over. So for me, it's like oh, happy Easter. So first thing I want to share is I got these off of um, a yard sale, like a Disney yard sale site. So this isn't something that like I purchase anywhere, but I got, excuse me, the Tsum Tsums. I got um, Lotso and Sully. And I just think that they are adorable. Um, I want to get more, but I just think they are super adorable. And these retail for like $5.99 or $6.99 or something like that. $6.95. So I just think they're super adorable. I would love to get more and like fill in a shelf or something or half a shelf. But just the, I don't want to get a complete set. I just want to get the ones that I really want. Um, so yes, so I got those. I got more headbands. Um, so I'd like to share the ones that I got with you. Um, I just got three. So I got a villains one. I'm going to show you her Instagram too. So I get this really cool villains one. So it has like Captain Hook. Um, it has um, Jafar. It has um, um, where is it? The evil stepmother. I'm trying to like, it's hard. Um, it has um, from Snow White. So it third. This one's a little bit harder to see, but I love it. And then we have. I'm showing you the back of them because it's easier to show you than the front. But here we have Pooh and Friends. Pooh just has a really deep place in my heart. I love the Pooh and Friends. And this is the front, but it's a little bit harder to see than when you have it on. And then every time that she has like a baby Yoda or the child, um, I feel like I have to get it, especially like this one. Because look at how cute. Um, but this one I just thought was super, super cute. Just kind of acting goofy. So I got that one. I will show you the Instagram page right now. Um, right now she's busy making... Um, face masks, but she does a lot of, um, let me try to keep my hand, I don't know if you can see that, it's mermaid lagoon underscore creation, creations, creations, okay, so yes, um, so that's that. I got those three from her. Um, the next thing I got are these awesome stickers. I'm a huge planner. I want to do a planner person. I want to do a plan with me, what I use for my planner, how I plan, etc. Um, I just haven't gotten around to it yet. It's very hard to do with quarantine because there's, we're not doing a lot of stuff. I got these awesome stickers. Um, I kind of want to transition my stickers from being... Um, normal stickers to Disney stickers because I just find I found like a Etsy site that does um, Disney type planner stickers and they're super fun. So I got these awesome stickers. Um, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see. Oh, <laughs> this one I already took out. That's why it's white. Um, if I tilt them like that, you actually might be able to see them better. So these ones are Disney princesses, as well as these ones and if anybody's wondering what my nails are these are actually color street I am a distributor I'll leave my link down below if anybody's interested um, these ones are like Disney and Pixar and Star Wars and all that stuff super cute and these are all Tsum Tsum like stickers and I love these because they're small and circular so they fit in a lot of like little things and these are on Etsy and I will show you the Etsy shop right now I feel like it's just easier for me to show you the shops on my phone and tell you um, 
because then if you want to buy them you can she there this shop is actually on vacation right now but if you go to her shop and you click on it and you scroll down they'll give you other shops that are like them um and actually you know what let me let me actually just give you the other shop because um the shop is just incredible so this is the shop i'm currently going to be ordering through um the, to do my new planning stuff but this is the planning this is where I bought these ones through is where I'm going to show you right now but this shop is on vacation right now This shop isn't the one that's on vacation. Or maybe she just took it off vacation because this morning it was on vacation. Um, okay, so there's that. I love these. I actually just started using some of these. Um, okay, so next from um, Sierra Allen, I got um, pins. My pins are actually on my pin board, so I cannot show you them. But I did want to give her a shout out um, because her pins are incredible. She... Um, she does pin trading and pin selling so i actually wanted to give her a shout out because her pins are um incredible so let me show you her page that is her page right there um i don't know if you can see it or not okay yeah she does Disney um, pin trading and pin selling and all that stuff. Her pins are incredible. I've gotten a lot of pins. I've probably gotten 20 pins from her and I'm actually getting pins for her um, because she needed a few that I actually was able to score. So um, this next one is next one is um I got these in the yard sale too I belong to a Disney yard sale I just figured I'd show you um I got this really cute um I want to put this on one of my backpacks is this really cute um Mickey um rainbow I can show you actually the Disney yard sale that I belong to um rainbow Mickey and then I got this I'm actually going to save this this is super heavy so I don't know um, these are, it's like, they're not diamonds, these are all just like, um, it's almost like beveled Mickey, or mini ears, but it's super heavy, so I don't want to put it on a backpack. I'm going to put this one on a backpack. I don't know what I'm going to use this for, because it is so heavy. This one's $15, um, and this one's $10.95. This is a lounge fly keychain. They're just so heavy that I, I don't know what I'm going to use them for yet. The one is. Um, but I did not pay that for them. I think I paid like $5 each. That's what's great about the yard sale. So let me show you on Facebook. Um, it's a Facebook group. Um, I'm sorry. It's Disney Flea Market, not Disney Yard Sale. Um, and that's what it looks like. Then I got this, which I'm in love with. You know that if you've watched any of my, my videos, my unboxings, um, you know that I love um, straw toppers. I'm such a fan. And my favorite character, my top three favorite characters is Chip. Um, and I was able to score this Chip um, straw topper. And I think he is adorable. I don't know if I'll ever use him because he seems very fragile. But I just had to have him. I think he's adorable. Um, and he came from So Full of Crafts. Um, so Full of Crafts dot Etsy dot com. Just cover up my. Okay, 
So I'm just going to put him back here with the rest of my stuff. Um, so that's that. Um, so then the next thing I got is actually dirty. I wore this yesterday, but I'm still going to show you. I got this from Shop Disney. Um, and this is a Monsters Inc. shirt, and you can see it's so dirty. I ended up putting a hoodie over it, so it has like little balls of fluff all over it. It has Sully and then Mike Wazowski's down there, and it says allergic to humans. I'm such an introvert that this shirt was perfect for me. This is actually a men's shirt, um, but I got it off of ShopDisney.com. And they had a sale when I bought it a couple weeks, like maybe excuse me, like a week ago. I actually got it like two days ago, so I put it right on. And then I got this. I am actually going to be running the Walt Disney Marathon next year. I belong to a Run, Do a run Dopey group. Um, if you are running the Run Disney or any of the Disney group, the any of the Disney marathons or half marathons or whatever, there are Facebook groups out there that you can join. Um, I'm in a dopey group and one of the girls in there, um, her name is I Idalis, Idalis, I'm sorry I'm probably butchering that, but she actually makes these shirts. It's a racer back and it says um, run Disney, um, every mile is wicked and if you look it has um, pirate hat, it has Ursula um, with her like tentacles, then it has the Cheshire cat, um, it has like um, mummy wrapping, it has um, Maleficent, and then it has, um, I can't think of what that is, <laughs> um, what is that, oh, um, from, um, uh, Snow White. Who's blanking? I believe Snow White. If I'm not blanking. But yes. So this is something that I will be wearing over the summer while I train. Um, not right now. It's still too cold. So I got that. Um, so if you're in these Run Disney groups, we're actually going to be running a virtual 5K come up in May. So then my next one is... I, I bought four tumblers, only three of them came. The one that didn't come was a jasmine tumbler. Um, I also have three more coming, I believe. One is one of which is a Beauty and the Beast style tumbler and it has like the rose and the glass, but um, that one did not come yet. The first one is the one that I'm drinking out of now. Um, it has my name on it. And then it has these, it's glittery and it has, um, Mickey Mouse, oh that's Minnie Mouse, sorry, Minnie Mouse, and then it has Mickey Mouse up there with rainbows and um, four leaf clover, four leaf clovers and, you know, different, you know, lucky things. Um, this is a 20 ounce skinny tumbler. The next one that I got is not Disney related, but I love the Golden Girls, so I got a Golden Girls. <laughs> this is a 30 ounce skinny tumbler. And then the last one is kind of a retro style 30 ounce skinny that is Little Mermaid. So like Ariel's kind of retro, but then you have um, Flounder being like super traditional, like normal. Um, and Ariel kind of doesn't look typical. So it's, um, yeah, but I really liked it. I liked the colors. I liked how it wasn't bright bright um, purple it was kind of like muted um, and then the jasmine one is like really really pretty um, so yes yeah, so that was that and then the last couple of things that I got that I wanted to share with you were some ears I did purchase some ears off of um, off of the yard sale and they are all legit Disney ears um, so I do have to stand up which I don't want to do but I'm going to do I'm going to take these out of here though because I got to back here so the first set of ears I got were these all these ears were discounted um, everything in the air sale comes with tags on them and they're discounted so I did pick up these ones I've had my eye on these ears forever and when I saw these I had to pick them up they're just so 
they've basically just been discounted like five or ten dollars it's just somebody who bought them and didn't want them anymore or wants to trade so sometimes people will say like i have these does anybody have a different pair of ears i like to trade for so that kind of thing so i've had my ear my eye on these for a long time um finally got these um i had my eye on these as well i think I think I got these ones as well, the Epcot ears. And then, we'll stand up. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, and then I have these I got from Etsy. Okay, so I got three more pairs. I kind of splurged. So it's a funny story about those ones, I'll tell you in a second. So then I got these flower ones which are really pretty. Um, I got these chocolate ones with the thin ear, which, like, some of these are ones that I wouldn't have purchased at full price just because I'm like, mmm. But to, to get a little bit money off, I'm like, totally would, totally would buy these. To have them in my collection. So these I actually bought off of the thing, off of, like, the yard sale. And then I ended up, they ended up being on sale on Shop Disney. So now I have two pairs. And um, that's how much I really wanted them. Apparently, I bought two pairs. And then these ones I actually bought on Etsy. Um, I'm in love with them. Like the steamboat, you know, the steamboat look, steamboat style, um, Mickey and Minnie retro. Um, I actually, ooh, these, so these are made. These are not actual... Disney Parks ears. I just love these. Um, and I will show you where I bought those from. I do have more um, private uh, or handmade ears coming as well. But those just take longer. So once those come in the mail, I will share those. Um, let's see. So this one was from... this shop right here got ears so yeah so that is pretty much it that's all that I have and yeah I will be sure to try to link all of the shops below if you guys have any questions about anything that you saw in the video let me know and I will try to get back to you guys as soon as I can all right, hope you guys have a good Easter. Um, stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.